Well, we're doing Danny in the Deep Blue Sea. Um, as a lot of people know, it's been done probably 3,000 times in the last few years. Um, we love the play. Um, I was about to do the play about five years ago with a woman, but uh, Nathan, for the last couple of years, has read it and over and over told me, look, this should be two guys. And in uh, what's been happening just in the gay and lesbian community with marriage and this and that, the play talks about that a lot, so we thought, Let's take it on. He's playing Robbie instead of Roberta, and I'm playing Danny. Great. Give us a brief description of the show. Um, it's two pretty fucked up people who meet at a bar and uh, for their own reasons kind of fall in love uh, or lust. I don't exactly know which one it is, but uh, they're messed up, and they're messed up the same way, and they kind of f fall for each other. They're, they save each other, I think would be the appropriate way to say it. Um, and go home, and shit gets messy. Yeah. Great. What are you most excited about? Doing a damn play, man. Yeah, so excited. So excited that the fr we're doing it with the Fringe. But this is the first time we've done a play for the Fringe. Is your first play? My first full play, my, my premiere, I guess you could call it. But I've done a lot of improv and things almost th with the Fringe that a lot of my friends in my improv group have done, but this is the first time I've done the Fringe or a, you know, this first, is my First time premiere. being a uh, Fringe festival for me too, yeah. and uh, excited to do that. It's been a few years. I've been working in, in movies and TV, but theater is, it's good to get back. It's exciting. Awesome, what's your favorite line? Um, go ahead. From Danny in the Deep Blue Sea. Uh, I said get off my case, bitch. <laughs> Not like that, of course, but that's pretty cool. I, I guess that's my favorite line, too. It's a great line. Great. Well written. Well, give us some hope for your show. Why should we come? Danny the Deep Blue Sea. Gay play. First time ever. Twist on Shanley's uh, classic. And uh, mm -hmm. hopefully he won't hate us for doing it because he didn't give us permission. Donation only. <laughs> that's why we're not charging so that we can do this play as a fringe experiment. And I think, uh, I, I mean, the way we've been rehearsing and with our great director, Michael, Chris Falusi, who's actually the co-director at the Gay and Lesbian Theater here in Los Angeles, celebration. Celebrate the Celebration Theater, uh, he's directing us. I just think it's going to put, I mean, this, it's, it's putting something on the play that, uh, I don't know, now, now that we've done it together so long as two guys, I can't imagine doing it with a girl because it makes sense. I mean, it could be two guys, it could be two women. Uh, it could be to anything that meet in a bar and, and have this thing that happens between them and next day one of them's like, get out, and the other one really still thinks this is true. So I'm, I'm very excited. Come see the show. We'll be wearing this. We just came from rehearsal. Yeah, I didn't know. I was, yeah.